Hey guys, this is Neon Nezi back again with another Destiny 6 video. Today we are doing a challenge both from, uh, it's from actually a viewer. It wasn't actually a, a challenge, but then Easy and I made it into a challenge. So Azor Ahai in my free to play Medina Nightmare auto team with Paper Soho and Paper Sierra commented, in my opinion, the best video for everybody is a universal team that could auto the whole nightmare rock, paper, scissor, which basically he's saying that the core three should have rock, paper, scissor elements so that they can always have the advantage no matter which um, faction they're dealing with. And this does have a lot of pros to it because not everybody has time to build all the monsters, not everybody has um, the resources to build all the monsters that they have even. So I was at first kind of, I didn't want to make the video on this because in my opinion, this, this would be a all four star video in because if i say use let's say paper adonis and if that person doesn't have paper adonis then it's not really universal it might be universal for the game but it's not going to be uni universal for all the players but then easy said that he was going to make a video using some of his natural five stars so i was like you know what how about we do a challenge like whose teams can clear off this the fastest so what we're going to do is we are going to do uh in this order from easiest to hardest Jin, silvis inua medina um, and whoever has the fastest clear time overall, we're going to add all the clear times and whoever has the fastest clear time is the winner. The loser will give the winner a gift card code, which the winner can give away in any one of his videos. So, and, um, every time you lose, you have to count the time that it took you to lose or that, that failed run, you need to consider the time of that failed run as well. So I know that I have a higher orb and crest grade when it comes to my units. So what I'm doing is I'm going to be using Rock Benito. I'm just gonna show you guys my uh, orbs here really, really quick and their stats. So I'm gonna be using Rock Benito because while he does make the clear times faster, he's a lot more riskier. I would much rather have Rock Jun or um, someone else that heals, like even Soho would be better here in terms of being more safe. Because it's not how clear every every um, every run is, guys. It's can you do it all in the first run? Because the moment you fail, that's like almost 30 or 40 seconds more. Uh, so hopefully I don't fail. <laughs> But yeah, that's the reason why I'm using Rock Benito, because with him, there is a higher chance for me to fail in Inua and Medina factions, at least. And I'm using Rock Arcana, simply because when she comes on, and if I already have an Adonis shield, her shield will replace. So the invulnerability shield that Adonis provides, which makes you take no debuffs and no damage, is now just going to be a shield that just is immune to debuffs, but you still take damage, which can be very, very bad in terms of Silvus and Medina. So in this case, uh, overlapping between the boss, because this isn't a defense and a defense. It's not like Soho and Yona and one of them in the tracker position, position. This is completely two different buffs, Invulnerability Shield and Immunity Shield. And in this case, they don't stack or um, overlapping them is not beneficial at all. It's actually a bad thing for me. So anyway, I know that I've had problem problems with music in the in the past, but hopefully this right here, you guys can handle. And let's get straight into the runs, guys. <laughs>
All right, guys. So, holy cow. I thought for sure we were going to fail in uh, Medina. And I was hoping to God that this is what happened. I was hoping to God that my Adonis would have his shield up. And then my Arcana would use her ability to reduce the cool time on the shield so that he could use the shields again. But she never came out, which is fine. We still <laughs> we still did it all everything in one run. So if I'm not mistaken, my clear times were 53 seconds, um, 67 seconds, 99 seconds, and then 78 seconds. So that's a total time of 297 seconds for all of them. So easy. Uh, I wonder what time you got. I was pretty certain that I was going to fail in Medina. If I had, that would have been very, very detrimental. But thankfully, I didn't. Um, is there anything else I want to say? Oh, yeah. Destiny Void, guys. We are recruiting. I was holding off on kicking a few people. I was holding off on kicking a few people uh, simply because they have been in the guild for so long, right? But now we do have 10 spots open, exactly. So please go ahead and send your requests in. Uh, at this point, all I care about is that you guys can kind of auto everything or speed clear. But what I really need you guys to do is have a conquest team because that's what we're trying to do, get these guild skills up. So we're trying to get this one over here to reduce orb and crest enhancements. Then we're going to go over here with the XP. And this gets crazy, guys. This this gets crazy. At level 10, we have to get about a million, almost 1.5 million of these uh, guild points. So uh, we basically need people that can auto hell or possibly nightmare. Hopefully you guys can auto nightmare, uh, speed clear giants, do I don't care what you guys can do in Destro or not, and then ov obviously have uh, two conquest teams and maybe just one team for a cleanup or whatever. So hopefully I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, Easy and I spent about an hour and a half today, an hour and forty minutes actually, just uh, thinking about different videos. We came across one video that we can make on his channel, which is going to come out very very soon. And then maybe next week we'll talk about a video that we can do on my channel, which will come out in the later future. So anyway, um, what do you guys think about this challenge? If there are other challenges that you want me and Easy to do, let us know and we will try to do them. But of course, we both need to be capable of doing it in such that it can't be with certain units because we both might not have the same units. But whatever, guys, just give us challenges and we'll do them because right now, like... We are just having this amazing um, brotherhood, this amazing friendship, and I hope it takes us long and steady into the future. And hopefully, the game, um, the game starts starts bringing out some really, really good new content for us all to enjoy. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any questions, anything at all, let me know in the comment section down below. I always, always, always reply to everybody that comments. And if you guys like my content, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Helps keep me motivated. And until the next time, guys, Neon out.